So this came from one of our plots. We are carrying out some um, pesticide trials. We are just basically trying to see which of the, uh, which of three organic pesticides are more co cost effective against um, a number of uh, vegetable pests. Now, this is coming from the plot where we sprayed azadiractin. And we've been consistently observing that the azadiractin product is being very effective against the tomato hornworm. And this is a, a tomato hornworm that has been killed and it's all shriveled up. Um, that's how we want them to be. If you are going to have tomato hornworms on your farm, you want them to be in this state. But having said that, I want to also make a point that in I IPM, if you have the opportunity to kill every single pest in your field, I know this sounds counterintuitive, but you are not supposed to do that. If you have the ability to kill every single pest, you are not supposed to do it. We are not supposed to be greedy, leave some pests out there for the natural enemies to feed on so that you have your first line of defense kept alive for when there's another outbreak later on. So the idea is not to kill every pest in the area. The idea is to reduce their population below a certain threshold where they don't cause economic loss to us. Thank you.